amazing parent. Hi, purposeful parent. Good morning and happy Sunday. How are you doing today? Hope you went for service. Hope you went to church. Whatever works for you. All right. As you can see, I just came back from church and I want to drop something very quick for us today. I want to start by asking you, what is your holiday plan for your family? Especially when it comes to your children. All right. I personally, I believe that holiday is a time for children to rest and get refreshed for the next academic session. So I don't believe in sending your child back to school to continue with the paperwork. No. What's the rush for? They are still going to go back to school after this holiday, right? I only believe the reason why you should send your child to school is if that school is going to be a new school for your child. That is, if you are changing your child's school from a previous school to another school with a tangible reason. You know, changing schools for children, it's not always the best, all right? If you have a, a tangible reason to do that, that is the only reason I believe the child should go for summer classes in that school. Why? In order to get acquainted and familiar with that school, all right? So that when school starts, the child can flow with the lesson and not trying to get familiar with the school environment, the new classroom, the student, other students, the teacher and everything. All right. So what is your holiday plan? If you don't have a holiday plan, let me tell you what will happen. You are going to overindulge those children. They are going to spend more time on the screen. Now, I'm not saying spending time in the screen is bad. No. Whether we like it or not, technology is here to stay. All right. This is a digital world. OK. But what I'm saying, we should avoid excessive use of the screen time reduce it don't always have them stay in front of the screen whether it's the television their tablet the laptop anything let me tell you what is happening when a child spends more time in the screen the visual part of the brain is the only one that is developing the visual aspect of the brain is the only one that is developing and that is why the child finds it difficult when he goes into the classroom to actually learn with other students in terms of other logical aspects of teaching. Why? Because the child has only succeeded in developing the visual aspect of the brain. All right? So don't allow them to stay in front of the screen so much because they are in the holiday. That's is holiday period. They can watch television. No, have a holiday plan. All right. And don't send your child to families you don't know their family system. I've heard some parents say, oh, Halem, I can't wait for the holiday to bundle those children and send them to one family or the other. Simply because you want your time to yourself. They are your kids. Some pa parents will call me because I am a teacher. Ah, when is school starting? Why? You want to send them back to the teacher. Kudos to you teachers. They are your kids. Don't send them to families who don't know their family system. They are by creating work for yourself. When they come back, you have to start retraining. Re remember, holiday period provides us with a beautiful opportunity for families to bond more. All right? So go and have fun with your children and have a holiday plan. God bless you. I love you. Have a blessed week. Bye.